And hi, well, this is Francisco from Wondershare Mobile Trends. And in today's video, I'm going to be talking about everything that you need to know about 5G. So let's go ahead and dive right in. So what is 5G? 5G is the fifth generation standard for broadband cellular networks, which companies began deploying worldwide back in 2019. And it's the planned successor to 4G networks, which provide connectivity to most current cell phones. So basically, it is a new global wireless standard after 1G, 2G, 3G, and 4G networks, and one that surpasses these by a landslide when it comes to performance. So how does 5G work exactly? It is pretty complicated to understand how 5G works, even even if you search online. So let's go ahead and explain it in the easiest way that we can think of. 5G a network provides faster connections and lower response time. So first of all, 5G networks use the macro cells, small cells, and in-building systems to improve the connection overall of your cellular data. And secondly, the increased spectrum enables 5G to have more users, more data, and faster connections with less throttling overall. And then thirdly, 5G will use massive MIMO, which actually stands for multiple input, multiple output antennas that have very large numbers of antenna elements or connections to send and receive more data simultaneously. And the benefit to users here is that more people can simultaneously connect to the network and maintain high throughput without interruptions of any kind. So then, what are the differences between all of the Gs? The first thing that you need to know is that G stands for generation. Each generation is defined as a set of of telephone network standards, which actually detail a technological implementation of a particular mobile phone system. And the speed increases, and the technology used to achieve that speed also changes and improves over time. So for example, 1G offers 2.4 megabytes per second, 2G offers 64 megabytes per second, 3G offers 144 kilobytes per second to 2 megabytes per second, whereas 4G offers 100 megabytes per second to 1 gigabyte per second, and is based on LTE. LTE technology. So how fast is 5G? 5G actually tops out at 10 gigabytes per second. And that means that it is 100 times faster than the current 4G technology at its theoretical maximum speed anyway. And if you have no idea what this means, then just imagine this. You could very much download a two hour movie in just 3.6 seconds on 5G versus six minutes on 4G or 26 hours on 3G, which is pretty insane. So how will 5G change our lives in the end? Well, 5G can impact our lives in many aspects. Let's go ahead and take a look at the healthcare industry as an example. Patients can be monitored in real time uh, thanks to 5G technology. Their key indicators will be sent by devices constantly. In the ML-driven industry, vehicles can share info with each other in real time to avoid any kind of accidents. So then, when will 5G be available in my area? PwC reports that US mobile operators had collectively covered around 75% of the country, that means the United States, with 5G, and the expansion of 5% more is expected by July. And if you want to check uh, for the nearest 5G tower near you, and you can go ahead and just go to T-Mobile's website and then you can look at the entire 5G map so that you can see where every tower is currently located. And if it makes sense for you to, and to go ahead and upgrade to a 5G network, you can go ahead and find that link in the description as per usual. Now, that's pretty much everything that you need to know about 5G so far. Now, this technology is only expected to get better with time and 5G is proof of just that. So let us know in the comments if you have any questions at all, and then leave us a like if you like this video. Also, make sure to subscribe for more content just like this moving forward. Now, with that said, until next time, enjoy.